Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy TYP336 here. Bring you uh, my uh, deck profile for what I was going to play tomorrow at uh, the Spartanburg, South Carolina Regional. I was actually going to be able to go, but last minute problems pre are preventing me from going. So, it's all good. Uh, I was going to uh, bring you the deck I would have played. Uh, just monitor deck. I know y'all are tired of seeing monitor deck profiles. Trust me, I'm going to get some dual videos in soon. Uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh community around here in, here in my town has really just died down. Like there's only like four of us, but uh, well, there's another shop in uh, Winston Salem. Like it's like 45 minutes away. I, I'm gonna try and get down there uh, whenever I can. Uh, bring y'all more deck profile, uh, more duels and stuff like that. Deck profiles to probably have some player discussions as well, because the Yu-Gi-Oh community there is a lot bigger than ours. Uh, but anyway, it's it's monarchs. I've um, you know, go ahead and get to the profile. I'll do the explanations. Uh, you got your three aethers, uh, three Eris, uh two Adia, and two Edos. Um, the reason why I did this is because the one problem I've I noticed in monarchs was. If you cannot get at least a tribute summon monster out with you like through using these two, if they if they stop you right there with Valor, you're pretty much done. If if you can at least get to the tribute summon monster and have like domain or march or what have you, some kind of way to soft lock them, then you're in an all right position, but like not a grand one. If, like if you can't get that monarch effect on, but it's still all good because it's still a 28 body they have to get over. Plus the field spell or march or what have you, but the problem I kept having is I kept these kept getting bailered. I was just like, "There's got to be a way to get around ba uh, playing uh, these in multiples and having to depend on these." And so it brings me to the next card in the list to Mithra. Mithra, I think, is an amazing card for Monarchs right now. And my friend uh, Michael Boyd, he uh, shout to you. He actually uh, pointed this out to me. I didn't even think of it, and I feel stupid for not even thinking about it. Special summoning this against BA, like going for uh, going first, bringing uh, and bringing out the token. You just shut off BA from summoning anything unless they dark hole the field, and like they're having to, and like that's still eating. That's still good because you're still you're still forcing them to waste a dark hole for a fucking token. That's really good, and. It also gives you an additional tribute summon. I didn't like. I just didn't really look at this card when I was start playing this deck. And this card's really this card's really busted. So I honestly think two two Mithra two idea two Edos needs to be the new movement here with uh, with Monarchs going forward, especially with BA now on the rise and being probably the most popular deck since Gold Series dropped. Um, uh, Double Karaz. Uh, one Mega Thistalos, uh, one Majesty Sphine, and two Effect Bailey. Uh, let's go around out the monsters. Uh, spells, we got Triple Domain. It's very standard. Uh, three Tenacity, three Pantheism, three Stormforth. Well, two Return. I thought about going to three on this, and I... No. Nah. I was gonna go to three and no March, but March is really good right now, especially with people going back to main dark holes and regekis and stuff like that. So I went to two return one March. Uh, Foolish and Twin Twister. I cut the Rota and the one for one just for the simple fact that I only had two targets, which was the two ideas, and I'm not gonna be specialing out my fucking effect brother. So I don't really need one for one and Rota like that. Um, that's it for the spells. Uh, traps you got. It's a, it's a little heavier trap count. Uh, three prime, one warning, and one escalation. Um, real quick, just changes I would make to the main if you play this deck. Uh, if you if anyone sees this deck before uh, the regional, I would cut one Karaz and one prime for. Um, a second Majesty's Fiend and a second uh, and a uh, one copy of Vanny's Fiend, just for the simple uh, just for the simple fact that 
true Mithra helps you get to your Monarch a lot easier than a the depending on AD and Edos. But at the same time, it's still a one. Uh, uh, you like you still have to have at least the domain, uh, the field spell. And if you can, and if you don't get to the field spell, it's nice to be able to lean back on a on a one drop rather than a two drop. And they ha and Majesty's Fiend Vein Fiend can uh, almost outright win you any game in this format. I feel plus with plus um plus with like March out or something like that. Like it just be it, it'd be honestly better. And like I've really not been liking Prime here a lot a lot lately. It's just it's not good in threes. It's really not. Um, onto the side deck. Uh, oh, and one other card, uh, Frost Blast, uh, the new Mark spell card uh, from uh, the Gold series. I would play that as well. Um, yeah, on a side deck, uh, one Majesty's Fiend, uh, uh, one Vayne's Fiend, two Maxis. Oh, sorry. Two Vayne's Fiend. I'm sorry, this is side out of order. My bad. Uh, two Vayne's Fiend, uh, two Maxi, one Nasty, uh, Double Trap Eater card. I still love this card to death. Uh, two Decree for the, uh, for BA. Uh, same Twin Twister, two MST, Regeki, and two Chalice. And, yeah, guys, that's my, uh, Mark that profile. This is what I would have played for uh, Sparkberg tomorrow. I felt like I would have did really well, especially if I could have made the changes like I was talking about with the Frost Blast and the uh, Match Season Bangs Uh One uh, one thing also, the, the, uh, if you do make that change, it, the deck will come out to forty one. Um, if there's something, if you if you're fine with that, then go ahead and play the uh, forty one. If there's something you didn't like in my list, uh, go ahead and drop it to forty if you can. Uh, but yeah, guys, this has been my Monarch deck profile. I'm TYP3336, TYP3 and I promise you the next video is not a Monarch deck profile. Peace, guys. Have a good night.